Here's Jamie Jarostik with the Miami Valley's certified most accurate forecast. We're looking from our Bryant heating and cooling camera, I-75 north of downtown, where it's been a cold morning commute here. Everybody's got their heaters on, I'm sure. We've had frost on the windshields as well. If the car's parked outside, you'll need a little extra time still to get that cleared off. Before you head out, a lot of spots are at or below freezing. It's 32 in Minster. We have 30 in Troy, 31 out towards Richmond and Eaton. Springfield's 33 now, Xenia 32. Dayton's been right around 37 degrees. It's a cold morning area-wide, and it's going to stay pretty chilly feeling through 9 a.m. And that's when our frost advisory and freeze warning will expire. And by 10 o'clock, we're up to 46. All of that frost will be gone. 56 and sunny at noon and into the 60s this afternoon, right around normal. Our high expected to be 64 degrees at 4 o'clock. So our weather headlines, some morning frost, then a nice mild afternoon. We do expect dry weather until we get to Wednesday. There'll start to be a slight shower chance and a warm up will ensue this week as 70 degree high temperatures return our normal high again in the 60s. But check out Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday and Friday will be into the low and mid 70s through that time. And then, of course, for the weekend, we're going to turn cooler. Saturday's not too bad, but by Sunday, a high of just 60. And then after that, there's even chillier air on the way for next week as we're approaching Halloween. Temperatures will be turning uh, below normal significantly with highs potentially by midweek next week, only in the mid-40s. Here's a check of our satellite radar loop. You can see the clear conditions out there. We've had a little bit of shallow fog in spots, but otherwise it's been very quiet. Future track shows sunshine as we go through the rest of the morning. At lunchtime, we may see a few high clouds grazing those northern counties, but the sun will still get through up that way and will stay dry. Overnight looks mostly clear, and that's how we'll start Tuesday in the morning, nice and sunny. By the time we get to the lunch hour, some high clouds drift in, and then later in the day, clouds will increase a little more. So by 5 o'clock, partly sunny, and it does look like a dry day as we warm up. Here's your forecast for today up to 64. After the morning frost, it'll be sunny and seasonably mild. Overnight, we'll drop back to 46, so not as cold, just a little chilly feeling. And tomorrow, we're up to 75 with increasing afternoon clouds. It'll be a little breezy and a lot warmer. And the warmer weather sticks around Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Highs will be in the 70s. Slight rain chances Wednesday and then again on Friday, but a better chance arrives over the weekend as it turns cooler.